Washougaler bus, baby. Commence the Washougal National 2021. All right, so many of you probably know that uh, Washougal is my home national motocross track. And um, I've come back here to race uh, the past few years. But uh, I haven't been to the national for a long time. I'm going to say probably since... Uh, 2005. So yeah, I'm going to the national, watching big boys ride, and uh, pretty excited about it. All right, so those of you that have uh, never been, uh, the Washington Motocross Track is in Washington, Washington, funny enough, and it's a, it's a fairly scenic drive once you get out into the mountains here, along the Washington River. Lots of big uh, evergreen trees. Just kind of out here in the woods of Washington. Um, really nice amateur week. A lot of people come down and swim in the river. Get all dirty and sweaty and nasty. And it, it feels pretty good. It's usually hot this time of year. So, yeah, pretty cool. Alright, so we just got through the uh, booze and weapons search, and uh, there's a helicopter behind me there. I guess there's uh, helicopter rides out here. Check out the track in the mountains. <laughs> rolling in, rolling into the track. There we go, there's, there's a banner. <laughs> Man, always dusty. Always dusty in the camping. Oh my gosh, this is a work of art. Look at this stuff, man. Look at that hill behind me. <laughs> Remo. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Kind of rethinking that uh, I want to race the uh, 125 Dream Race. <laughs> this is this is pretty sick. It's been a long time since I was on this. Looking primo. Here we are at the uh, basically first corner. This is the uh, Motorsport.com hole shot. So uh, there'll be a white line painted on here somewhere. And uh, yeah. That determines who gets the whole shot. A little track walk here. So, track cuts back in right over here. We bypass the first corner, which is right here. Big wall. Walk on the side of the big wall, trying to follow my ass into play. And just walk on the soft stuff. <laughs> Sticks to your shoes. It's got sawdust in it. Yeah. Sawdust and sand and stuff here in the in the first corner. TV camera. Yeah. Here we go. Here's the start. <laughs> like fourth gear wide open into this baby. 
pretty wild. Look at the size of those trees behind me. Pretty, pretty track. Just running by the mountains. Yeah. Yeah, I heard this stuff gives you wings. <laughs> Order from the best here restaurant. The Red Bull tent. Little double section here. Perfect for the free ride. Of the updated Olympic motto, faster, higher, stronger, Ugh. together, that theme of unity continues. I'm not really sure what the point of this thing is. It's like a, it's like a checkup. I feel like the fast ways around the outside there. <laughs> Rap. 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 <laughs> I'm not really sure what this jump thing is. Hopefully they're coming to fix this thing. <laughs> Alright, so I uh, broke my very first arm in this corner right here when I was 16 years old. I didn't have this uh, tunnel jump back then, but yep, I rammed my wrist into that berm. This one here, that's this hand right here with the crazy looking bones coming out of it. Jammed the bone and <laughs> blew it right in half. Um, then I threw it up on the berm and proceeded to uh, beat it into place because I thought that it was dislocated or something. I was just a dumb 16 year old and I wanted to ride on the track, so yep, very first broken arm right there. Got a little jump party at the whoops here at the finish line. Got a little jump here on the side of the whoops. Going down the handicap ramp. <laughs> The baby broke my uh, very second arm on these groups right here I took out this fence <laughs> must have replaced the uh, section that I ruined already <laughs> yeah I smashed my uh, hand between the tube and the handlebar I'm not exactly sure where but give you a little sneak peek of the loops here As I recall, I don't know how many years ago that was, but about 1996, 97, I don't know. I think I doubled in. It's on a CR125. Started uh, blitzing them, and then somewhere probably about like three loops up from there, right about two loops before the kids, I just had a little bit too much over the front end and, and caught them. Taller one on the front end. Got all squirrely and went straight in the fence. I feel like that fence has moved over a lot since uh, those days. That one doesn't look like it moved, but this one looks like it's moved a lot. <laughs> Little kids on the bikes. Oops, sorry, buddy. I got riding your way. Who's winning? Slam the door. Get him, he's coming. He's coming. <laughs> The, here's the triple off the downhill, but the base kind of looks like shit. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I mean, I suppose if your ball's out on the 450, but I talk about it like a fucking ski jump. I have nothing to it. Let the pace it out. Seven, eight, nine. 30. It's about a 90 foot triple. No. Not much of a face for a 90 foot triple. Hey, look. Uh, 
uh, Briar's here. Hey, Briar. He's the guy that does the uh, vlogging for uh, um, Alex Martin. So maybe Alex is here with his broken arm. Interesting. Maybe Ronnie Mac's here. He also does Ronnie Mac. Check that fucking sender out. <laughs> I don't know what that is, but that's like a 60 foot face. It goes straight out into nothing. That'll be fun to watch on TV. <laughs> So it's where you uh, where you got that uh, works suspension. So you can just full send off that thing. There's a video from a couple years ago that is so sick. I cannot remember which rider it is right now, but uh, they just last lap going for the last pass. Just fucking moon launched it off that thing. It was awesome. Well, yeah. So I'm gonna see if I can uh, meet up with a Briar and uh, maybe we'll get you some cooler vlog stuff. <laughs> <laughs> on the spree in the whoops <laughs> alright it's 11pm here Washuga Motocross Park I'm uh, gonna go to sleep I'm gonna watch some movies on my iPad here first but uh, yeah I'm just here in the sleeping in the car the Carhartt pillow and uh, a blanket took off my muddy shoes <laughs> so the, the party started here probably much more so down in the field I'm actually up right next to the track um, by the starting gate but uh, yeah I'm uh, call me old but I don't really drink and uh, I just want to scream tomorrow be excited about some motorcycle racing check out for the night so that I can uh, do that tomorrow catch you guys later